welcome back to my channel so mind the state i look right now like i've literally got spots and stuff all over my face from wearing a mask and i've been really run down lately so i don't know what's going on with my skin but today i thought i would do another day in the life vlog so today i need to dust my bedroom and then start packing my stuff to go back to university because i'm actually moving back to uni tomorrow and also in this video i'm going to be trying like the new mcdonald's menu because i brought out like the new double big mac and like the is it the chicken jerk sandwich or something like that and i brought the mozzarella dip as well which i am so excited about so yeah i'm gonna be ordering that and trying that i don't know how i'm gonna feel about the double big mac because i don't actually like like double cheeseburgers and stuff like that i just think it's too much but anyways we'll see so for now i'm gonna go downstairs get some breakfast and then probably gonna dust my room okay, so because i'm ordering a mcdonald's later i actually just decided to have a yogurt and a cup of tea for breakfast so I want to eat this, watch a bit of TV, and then I need to get started on the day because I forgot that I also need to do some thumbnails for my videos, which are coming next two weeks, so, yeah. Okay, so I just got washed and brushed my teeth and now I'm just going to do my makeup for the day. Sorry about the angle, I've actually broken my tripod so I need to order a new one. So I'm currently just like propping it up with my lazy arm at the minute. So yeah, I'm going to do my makeup, do my hair and then I'm going to take some thumbnails for some videos. <music> Okay, so I've done my makeup. I've just gone for like a really like subtle look today. I've literally just put like foundation, concealer, powder, done my brows, put a little bit of highlighter on and some lipstick. So I used the MAC Will Lip Liner and I actually opted for my Velvet Teddy lipstick today. I never ever wear like matte lipsticks anymore. I always use like liquid lipsticks, but I forgot how nice the formula of MAC lipsticks are. So I've just realised that I left my straighteners at university. So I'm going to go and grab my mom's straighteners real quick. So I'll be right back. my makeup and i've straightened my hair but i'm now going to stick a different top on and then take some pictures for some thumbnails okay so i've taken the pictures for the thumbnails for my videos and it is now currently five past two and i'm feeling a bit peckish so i think i might order my mcdonald's now yeah let's do that let's uber eat this food and see how good it is okay, so i've ordered my mcdonald's i ordered the double big mac the jerk sandwich or whatever it is but i didn't get the jerk sauce because um don't really like spicy stuff so sorry guys but yeah i still got like the cheese on it though so we'll see what it's like and then i also got the dippers that they've brought back so i am excited to try them but whilst i'm waiting i've got like 15 minutes before my food comes i'm actually going to take pictures of my the first four days of my advent calendar so basically i'm not coming back from uni till like the 5th or the 6th of december so i actually opened the first four doors of my beauty advent calendars last night this video should be going up like the first week of december or like the second week of december so i can actually show you but basically what i'm going to do every day on over on my instagram is unbox the doors and like take pictures so you can see like kind of what you got in the advent calendars so if you would like to see that then go follow me over on my instagram which is at claireheadley16 but yeah i'll show you the first four things that i got in the glossy box advent calendar my body shop advent calendar and my charlotte tilbury advent calendar okay so the deliveries just came so let's open it okay so i decided to get a hot chocolate because i don't ever think i've actually had a hot chocolate from mcdonald's before so i got one of them okay so here is the double big mac can we just take a second like look how cute this box is 
like I don't think I've like ever had anything Christmassy from McDonald's like sorry but I'm just like a plain Big Mac kind of girl but these boxes are so cute like hmm Wow, well, this is a bit all over the place. What is that? Let us just sort it out a minute. Okay, that's a bit better. So here is the double cheeseburger. Like there's two beef patties there and then two beef patties here. Oh, I've got a feeling I'm just gonna end up taking like two of them out because I really hate bakers with like two patties together on them. So that's a big man. And then I have the cheese melt dippers, which I'm so excited about because I love the cheese melt dippers. I just got like the pack of three, no way was I going to eat 20 ounces of whatever it is to myself, so I got them. And then I have my fries and the tangy tomato dip that I didn't ask for because, fun fact, I don't actually like this dip. Like, sorry if you do, but I just really don't. Okay, so here is the chicken jerky sandwich. Again, look at the packaging, like it's just so cute. And this is what it looks like. I'm not gonna lie, the bun looks really, really nice. I think it's said it's done with like sourdough bread or whatever, but I'm really looking forward to trying this. So yeah, let's give them a taste and see what they like. By the way, does it ever annoy anybody else on Uber Eats how you don't get tomato sauce sent with your meal? Like it really irritates me. So I'm just gonna go grab some ketchup and then I'll be back. Okay, so I'm back and I've got my tomato sauce. Okay, so I'm gonna try the double Big Mac first. Okay, that just tastes like a normal Big Mac, but um, it's just too many beef patties. So it's like, like I said, I don't like double cheeseburgers. So I just don't like double beef patties. So it is nice, it's just like a normal Big Mac, but I like wouldn't be eating four patties and one bun so I'll probably take two of them out. Okay so next I'm going to try the jerk chicken sandwich. Like I said I didn't get the jerk sauce because I don't like spiciness but hopefully it'll still be nice. Thank god the bread is so soft. Okay. Mm. Okay that's really nice. I very much approve of that. That is unreal. That is such a good sandwich. I really, really like that. Okay, so lastly, let's try the cheese melt because I'm excited for this. Oh, look at them. The back. And I love them. Mm. So good. So good. Mm. And lastly, let's try the hot chocolate. I'm hoping this isn't going to burn my mouth off because normally when I have a hot chocolate I drink it when it's really hot and it ends up burning my tongue so cheers. Mm, that's a nice hot chocolate you know it's actually not too bad. Oh okay that's really nice it's just the right, right amount of sweetness for me so Overall, I approve. I mean, I think the Big Mac is probably my least favourite, but it just tastes like a Big Mac, like it's nothing really special. They've just literally added two extra patties in it. I love the chicken jerk sandwich, so I might actually try it with the sauce on next time. And obviously the cheese melts, absolutely love every single year. And the hot chocolate's really nice, so I hope you enjoyed this segment of me trying the new McDonald's menu. But I'm gonna go now and eat this. I'm probably not gonna eat both burgers and the sandwiches, let's be honest, so. My mom can probably have that when she comes home, but yeah, I will catch up with you guys in a bit. Okay, so mind the way I look right now, I've just literally shoved my hair back because I was eating my McDonald's, so yeah, I've just shoved it back for now. I've actually got a really bad like headache, which is like behind my right eye, but I actually got interrupted whilst I was unboxing everything and taking pictures from my advent calendars before. I actually got interrupted because my McDonald's came, so let me show you what I got in the advent calendars so now. In box number one, I got this coconut hand cream and then in box number two i got the body shop vitamin c glow sheet mask then in box number three i got a nice loofah and then in box number four i got a nail file and this is actually like double sided which i think is really cute but i'm actually so glad i got this because i actually needed a new nail file that's what was in the body shop calendar if you're wondering why it's laid down and not stood up it's because 
all the products like move around when you take the boxes out so i'm gonna put them back in now so they don't move around okay mind the light i've actually had to put my flash on because my bedroom's starting to get really dark but this is what i got in the first box for the glossy box calendar so i got the brushworks complexion and contouring like blend beauty blender set which i think it's really really good and cute i've never had a mini beauty blender before so i'm excited to try these and then in the second box i got the illamasqua liquid eyeliner and i actually haven't had a liquid eyeliner in quite a while so i'm excited to use that and then in the third box i got this i don't even know how to pronounce this is it Philoga, Philoga, I don't even know, but it's basically a multi correction cream, like miniature one. And then in box number four, I was so excited because I've always wanted to try Pixie products, and it's actually got 80 milliliter glow mist, which is just like amazing. Like, I'm actually like obsessed with the packaging as well, so I'm so excited to try this. Okay, so lastly is my Charlotte Tilbury advent calendar. This one actually only has 12 drawers, so I'm kind of like opening one, missing a day, opening one, missing a day. So I opened the first two drawers, and the first drawer had the Charlotte Tilbury Beauty Light wand in it, which I'm like so excited to try because I've heard such good things about it. And then this is the Copper Lights Colour Chameleon, which I am so excited to try. Like, look at the colour of this. Look how beautiful. I'm just actually like obsessed with it. I decided to put my light on because it's quite dark and it just doesn't do it justice in normal lighting. So, yeah, I absolutely love it. Yeah, that is basically the first few things I got in my beauty oven calendars, which I'm like, I absolutely love every single product. So, I'm really excited to open like the rest of the drawers. So, yeah. So, I now need to go up in the loft, get my suitcase and my hold all, and then I need to start packing my stuff to move back to uni tomorrow. So I've got my little suitcase down and I've also got my hold all down i'm kind of thinking that i'm going to try and put like my hold all in my suitcase because i don't think i'm going to need to take that much back because i'm only there for two weeks before i have to come home so yeah i'm going to try and sort all of this out now and see how it goes by the way can we just take a moment to appreciate this wreath like how cute is it i'm going to use my other command hook at uni to actually put this on the outside of my door so i think it's just gonna look really cute and then i've got like christmas cards for my flatmates and then I've got like this really cute like pink tinsel to go around my headboard, which was a pound from B&M. So yeah, hopefully it'll all look really nice. Okay, first problem. This doesn't fit in my suitcase, so I'm just going to have to carry that separately. Great. So I've packed my little suitcase for now. I can probably get like a few more things in it, but I've literally just like put in like kind of what I need to take back. Everything else I kind of have to sort out tomorrow. So yeah. So I'm thinking now because I've got them out the loft, I actually got my Christmas stuff in my bedroom out the loft the other day. So I'm thinking I might actually decorate my my bedroom for Christmas. So yeah, I'm going to get onto that now. So when I come home on the 5th or 6th of December, whenever I come home, I can actually have my bedroom christmas abide. Is that even a word? Probably not, but look like Christmas, basically. So I finished decorating my bedroom, mind the lighting, because obviously it is dark now and I've had to put my actual bedroom light on. But I'll just show you what I've done. Okay, so as you walk in my bedroom on my door, I've got my Christmas wreath. I am actually wanting to get like a longer thing. Uh, hang on, I'm just kind of using one of my coat hooks at the minute. But yeah, that's my Christmas wreath. And then on top of my chest of drawers, I have my advent calendars. And then this little Santa snow globe, these two little reindeers, and then my two nutcrackers, which I absolutely love. I'm obsessed with reindeers and nutcrackers, as you will see. And then on top of my shelf here, I've put my little silver reindeer. And then down here, I have a little deer, which is from Paper Chase. And then I have a little Christmas tree. And then on my window here, I have a little plaque that says Merry Christmas. And it lights up like loads of different colours, but I actually need to put some batteries in. So 
So yeah. that is my bedroom decorated for Christmas. I haven't done a lot, but obviously I've been bringing my decorations that I'm using in my bedroom at uni home and then I will have my Christmas bed in as well. So I will show you that in December when I come home from uni. But I'm going to end the vlog here because I'm actually not doing anything that's that interesting tonight. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below and press the bell notification to be notified every time I upload a video. And you can also follow me on my social medias, which will be linked down below. And I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.